hello everyone welcome back obapa is my name today i'm going to show you how to make basic lotion using a few ingredients very simple you don't need much ingredient this lotion is for beginners it's so easy to make so let's start formulating our lotion so you need distilled water 347.0 grams of distilled water please use distilled water because we don't want our lotion to be contaminated and you also need emulsifying wax 30.44 grams you can use any emulsifying wax of your choice but check the percentage usage rate we are going to use shea butter 25.07 grams you can choose to use mango butter cocoa butter any of the butters you can use them i will be using sweet almond oil 75.19 grams you can use to use any oil carrier oil of your choice and we are going to use jama plus preservative 2.08 grams it's compulsory to use preservative to preserve your lotion otherwise you can keep your lotion for long maybe one week and even they have to be in the fridge and we need fragrance that i'm going to use five grams you can choose to use essential oil of your choice so this is a few ingredients that we are going to use so all you have to do is combine your shea butter and your sweet almond oil and add your emulsifying wax we are going to melt them by using double broiler so easy to make so double broiler you just put water in a saucepan and put it on fire then set your two cups in it that's your water and your oil in it for it to melt so i'm going to use my high shea mixture it's not compose you to use your hair shea mixer you can use a hand blender and unfortunately my hand blender was poor so i have to change it switch it to my mixer but it's easy some of my recipe you have seen me using my hand blender to make my lotion but i have i'll get a new one then next time i will use that that one is very simple but this one when you are making a quantity of lotion large lotions like very quantity for it to mortify for you then you can use it but if you are making a little like this you can use your step blender but the same thing if you are making a little like this and you have it you can use it but most time if i'm making a little like this i don't worry myself using this machine i just use my hand blender or my hand step blender but because i bend the motor that's why i have switched to this so you blend it until it's mortifier so what we are going to do next is to check our temperature to make sure that we have the right temperature which is 1022 fahrenheit so that we can add our preservative so i will add my preservative and my essential oils or my fragrance oil this is the cool down phrase so if you are using any preservative please check the temperature of your preservative before you can add it to your lotion we are going to blend it again so that everything will blend very well very very well yes i said i'll be doing ph how to test your ph yes please i'll be doing it just that i don't have the ph people available the one i have has a spy so i have ordered some i can't use the machine to teach the ph alone because if i use the machine to teach the ph alone not everybody have that machine and that machine i think i bought it 400 or 500 dollars i forget the price 400 500 dollars not everybody can afford that so i have to use both the paper and the machine so that those who have the machine can do the test and those who have the paper can do the test at the same time so i promise i haven't forgotten it the minute the paper come in i'll be doing it so this phrase you cool down completely so this is a time to check your ph but i'm not going to show you how to check your ph in this one even though i check my ph so i put it in the cold water for it to cool down completely before i check my ph but the ph is okay for this particular lotion if you don't have the ph meter or the ph strip to check so i want it to cool down before i pour it to my container so when i check it then i pour it to my container but if you don't have it just let it cool down completely before you pour it to your 
container and as it's cooling down it's becoming thick a little even though we didn't use any thickener in it we just use emulsifying wax and you can use thickener in it but to make lotion and the distilled water you can exchange it for rose water lavender water and the rest but this is the simple way to go if you want to learn how to make lotion as a beginner this is a simple way to go and this is a very good moisturizer it's moisturized the skin very well this one everybody can use it that skin can use it fair skin can use it it's a very good moisturizer and babies can use it so after it's cooled down just pour it into your bottle or your container and you are ready to use it this is simple way to make lotion so if you don't know how to make lotion this is a few ingredients you need you need the steric water your oil and your butter and you need emulsifying wax preservative in your essential oil or your fragrance you can choose not to add any essential oil or fragrance to it because there are some people who don't love their product to have fragrance or scent in it especially those who have asthma most of their uh, cosmetic product they use doesn't have fragrance or essential oil to it so so simple to make if you have any comments please leave it below and if you have any requests please leave it below i'll be posting video every thursday and sunday so please every thursday come back to my youtube channel and watch my video time for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe